Lady Juniper and welcome to a different game that's not Genshin. This is Honkai Impact 3rd, Hoyo vs. Other Game. They do have more than one game, it might surprise you. This one, um, I've only been playing it a little while. I've been playing it for, I, mean, I think this starts at 80 days, so that gives you some idea. I I did try playing Honkai Impact earlier this year. Um, I think it was like September. I downloaded the game. I started playing it. It was the summer event. I played it for two weeks and I, I stopped playing it. And then I, I noticed it was on Steam and I was like, oh, I'll give it another go. I'll get through the story part that is a bit of a slog. And um i i haven't figured out how to open my old account on this which isn't much of a shame because well if you play honkai impact you can see i've been a little bit quite um Fortunate, you could say, in in my pools. Now, to be fair, uh, Hershey of the Void I got for free from starting a new account. I didn't get that with my original account, so I don't know if that's a permanent new player feature. Hershey of Reason, I I think I got from a drop. Durandel, I actually, I pulled on her banner and I got her in the first wish. I don't know how good that is. Uh, Miss Pink Elf. So there was like, when I started this account, this, this skin, Durandel, had a, a skin event going on. And I got Miss Pink in the box thing that was on the event. Uh, and then Himiko... I, I rolled on the dorm banner earlier today and she just came. So I have got a bunch of really good characters. Um, I don't like Fu Hao. Durandel is, is the character I like the most. When I previously played, I had this, this version of Durandel and I really, really enjoyed playing with her. And now I have this version of Durandale. So, all the, so really, starting a new account was a blessing because I've got the best version of Durandale, my favourite character. <laughs> I really like the Hershel region and I really like Miss Pink Elf. Um, I'm not biased because I love elves. I might be a little bit biased. Only a little bit. Yeah, I guess well, I thought I'd show you guys the game, how I've been doing. Oh, let's, let's show you the game. I've been playing the story. I won't. You, you must forgive me. I'm still getting used to navigating all this. This is an odd little game. I haven't done this yet, so let's try this. Let's try this. I haven't done this yet. Maybe I don't have Rita. Awkward. Let's not do that one. I don't understand it. <laughs> they've got they've got so much and I I have no idea. This is like I don't know what this is. Um I started playing this game because apparently there's a load of like Genshin related stuff to it. It's like this character. Her name is Raiden Mai, I think. And, um, yeah, the Shogun Raider, Raiden Shogun, is based off that. Can you tell that the Shogun is based off that? It's kind of obvious, right? <laughs> She's, like, one of the main characters in the game. Here's Miss Pink Elf. I don't ever want to do this. Because it's just showing off this character. I want to show you my characters. I can do this. I've already done it. So let me 
This is not a fawn. I just want to show you guys what this game's like. So this is my current team. I don't know. I don't think this is a good team combo. Um, just because, like, it feels like all of them want to be on the field. I don't think this game plays necessarily like Genshin. So, for one, you want a controller, really. Uh, I'm going to show you what I like Durandal. So, you press, press R. And, oh, he has a horse. Isn't that? Awesome. And then we crash in with our motorbike. So this, this I think, is the equivalent of the abyss. And this is the final floor. Easy peasy, right? <laughs> I don't know if it's harder or what. Um, amazing jiggle physics. But well, that's, I, I think, I think this is the equivalent of the abyss. I don't know. <laughs> it's like, like this game is quite a lot older than Genshin, and and because of that, it has a lot of content, but it's also got a lot that needs understanding. As well, and I don't, I don't understand any of this, any of it at all. I don't know what that is. I think I want these though. I've seen these. You know, let's do the story. I've got like this last little bit left. So this, this is why I didn't complete this. This is the same chapter I got to. It's because this entire chapter you're playing with Himiko in her different battle suits and only Himiko and her standard battle suits are, I just don't understand because you have to go find a tutorial somewhere else and finding that is so I can't find it when I want to find it and so you don't understand how she works and you've got all these objectives to meet and sometimes these objectives are really hard like really hard. You've only got one character whose moves you don't understand and you've got these objectives like don't get knocked down, don't take more than 2,000 damage. So you've just got to play really good. Um, Vonya here is another character, or well, this version of her, I don't like playing. So now I have to do whatever encounter this is. It's just Vronia. This is why it took me forever to do this, but I'm going to do it. I want to know the story of Honkai because I feel like the lore is important to Genshin. <laughs> Apparently this is a girl. It doesn't look like a girl to me. This just looks like an affirmative boy to me. There's not very many men in, in Honkai Impact. So if you want to look, see a lot of attractive ladies, I guess this game is for you. But like, he even sounds like a guy to me. <laughs> you can't hear it, obviously. I've, I've, I've turned the um, audio off. So you learn why I don't like Bronya. She's kind of like a charge attack character for what I understand of how her mechanics work. I really need to find my controller to play this game if I want to play it. So I think her thing is she is a big shield unit thing. I feel like everyone who plays Honkai Impact is just like, you're going so wrong. <laughs> I don't understand her. And the tutorial is like, you have to play a tutorial to understand the characters. I don't have time for that. I just want to be able to pick up and play them, not read. An instruction booklet. <laughs> oh, there we go. There's me failing. There we go. Big cannons. This is what you're going to do. Charge attack. And then hit him with the hands. Sometimes they'll set you up in an encounter with these these characters you don't know how to play with enemies that are resistant to them 
As if it wasn't difficult enough. Okay, let's charge up the cannon. Pew, pew, pew. It's hard to believe these are the same people that made Genshin Impact. Like, Genshin Impact's a beautiful game. I, mean, I guess this was made like three years ago. Four years ago, maybe. It's quite old. Let's go hit him in the face. He's just standing there. Bam, 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 bam. The only answer is violence. Let's see if Ebronia hit him in the face all the time. It should be much more enjoyable. I don't know if there's like a trick to get the energy to come back faster. It doesn't explain this to you. So like people think Bronya here is going to be the character they use for the Teresa in Genshin because mo there's a lot of the really big characters are based off characters in Honkai like oh the reason why I wanted to play Honkai is because of Al Haytheim and people like the moment Al Haytheim was like put up people kept saying he was an alternative reality version of Sue from Honkai Impact and I'm like who's Sue this is the first time I've heard that Hoyaverse apparently takes characters from the other game and puts it in Genshin and uh yeah, that's, that's the reason I'm playing this game now. <laughs> Secret Genshin lore. Here's, here's, here's the suit I've unlocked. I, I don't know what a Honkai is. What is a Honkai? What is Honkai energy levels? They don't explain this. They just say this word a lot. And it's meant to mean something. I don't know what her sure is. I don't know what's going on. It's one of those games where they use lots of words and it takes you forever to understand what any of them mean. Which I guess is fine if it's like a big release game. The Tales games are a bit like that. But this is a game that was released in chapters. <laughs> Imagine playing this and not know what a Honkai is. <laughs> well, I, I can't imagine because that's me. So the Hersher is the bad, bad guy that's infused with Honkai energy and has made them evil. I don't know. I have not explained what a Hersher is. So this is this is the new suit I've I unlocked today. Um, you get to play this when you do this chapter, you get to play her, but I have this suit, which is exciting, I guess. I don't, I don't, I don't like playing Himiko, making me play her for several chapters on her own has not made me fond of her. Tesla here apparently just is really good at machines. <laughs> okay. Here we go. There we go. She is all about the fire. This game is kind of more about dodging than Genshin is. Like, I know dodging is, of course, important in Genshin. Uh, just before I can get my combo. Ah. Uh, it should be okay. I should be able to get my combo. There we go. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. I don't know what any of her abilities do. It's all good. She looks cool. See, this, what, this battle suit is much easier to use than her other ones. <gasps> Who's that? I don't know. This game's kind of more like a, a visual novel. A visual novel with an action game attached to. I'm not really criticising it. I do like this game. <laughs> I do like the game. This is the character 
that people say um, the heavenly principles, God lady, is based on. You can you can kind of see the similarities, right? I think they have similar pupils and coloured hair, and sort of similar colour palettes, sort of. Himiko's boobs are very distracting. Uh, her show the way does sort of play it very similarly to how her boss battle goes. I think it's very cool. You get to fight against fight against characters. Oh dear, she does a lot of damage, doesn't she? Oh, I think I did her ult correctly that time. It's very fiery. Oh dear. The elemental damage. I don't know what that means. Tell me what it means. Did I do it? I think I did it. So, Himiko. So they both have like gems in them that make them make Hershers. And the Hershel of the Voids one's active. She has the Hershel of Fires one, but it's not active. It's kind of drawing on the power. Um, I don't know if she, she might potentially awaken into the Hershel of Fire. I don't, I don't know the story of this game. <laughs> I know Hershers are bad. I don't know why I'm trying to explain the story. I'm not even going to show much of it. <laughs> Sure, Hershers have daddies. Oh, we're going again. We're going again. Oh, ow. I wasn't expecting to go again. This is a surprise. Oh. Oh, oh, ow. I did it! I think. Yes! Hey, Jim. Oh. How are you the her what's going on? <laughs> I don't know. I just I just want like the backstory. Do I have to go read the manga to know what's going on? Oh are we gonna get a cutscene. Are we gonna get mate to meet Kevin? I don't know who Kevin is, but he's a character in this game. I just remembered you can't you can't hear the voice. Actually, I can't really tell if it's female or male. It's really, really quiet for me. Is is this going to kill the host? I feel like blasting someone with a ship cannon would kill the host. It sounds like it is. I, I thought the whole point was to try and save her. I'm confused. It is the Celine, the super cannon. Pew pew. Okay. Now what happens? She vanishes. The imaginary space. I have many questions. Not about the cannon. Um, about stuff you haven't seen to watch a cutscene now. Is she gonna die? I have heard that lots of characters die in this. Like, lots of characters. Apparently. I don't know. I just, I just see tweets about this randomly on Twitter. So, I, I, I know some characters do die. I just don't know which ones. I feel like this is too early for a character to die, right? Is she gonna die? What? Ooh. Dragon. This guy's horrible to fight. <laughs> With just him, I go.
animation is incredible. I love it. Huh. Oh, he in the void. Not done yet. These cubes look a little bit familiar, right? I thought they had that. thing uh, they got in previous chapters and and that can reverse the Honkai infection it, including really severe so there's like zombies in this and that serum can reverse the zombie state or purge uh, a Valkyrie of the power because like the Valkyries are powered by like a, a form of Honkai power or, or something. And I, I I am enjoying it. 
I know it's a little bit critical. I like loads of like events going on, like this this one. With Healy, who people think might be the baseline for the Archon of Fontaine. They think it's either going to be Seely or um, Durandal. I I kind of want it to be Durandal. I am biased. I like she's my favorite character. She would be a Claymore user, right? Don't you think he uses a lance? Where Seely um, uses a scythe. Which isn't a weapon that exists in Genshin. So I feel like Durandal is way more likely because they could make her a, a, a lance-like weapon. Either as a claymore or a spear. Where Seely, would they, they'd have to do completely different animations for a scythe. And that that wouldn't really work with all the spears. So I I'm favouring Durandal. I'm surprised she died so early in the story. Very surprising. Well, unless she comes back, anything's possible, right? I mean, it's surprising she didn't die, Kiana. I've got loads of her suits. So this is. Raiden Mai, Shogun. I don't have any of the other characters that are apparently been burrowed into Genshin. They got fish officially. I don't know if this is like a crossover thing, like like they took official from Genshin to promote Genshin to Honkai players. I don't know. I think no others is there besides the obvious Yamiko. If Yamiko was a bunny girl instead of a fox, does it look similar enough? How about this? That, that's less similar. This, uh, it's, it's Yay Sakura. Because Yamiko is a bunny girl. I don't know if we'll see more of these characters in Genshin. I don't know if, like, the costumes reveal anything. No, not really. There you go, if um Raiden Shogun <laughs> was in a sci fi fighting game, this is what she'd look like. <laughs> Jiggle. <laughs> oh wow. Jiggle jiggle jiggle. <laughs> I'm so immature. <laughs> Stuff, stuff. But yeah, um, I've kind of done already all the interesting stuff that one could have done today. Um, I'm still learning a lot about this game. Yeah, I think this is the tutorial. So if you want to learn about any of the characters or trial any of them, you can do that any time you want. For so all here for you to try out. I don't know who you are. But apparently these are the active banners. So they're available for you to try out any time. I don't know how regularly the banners fluctuate. Like I only wish for Durandel the other week. And a few weeks ago it was the hair show of human ego. And the Jade Knight I think was before Durandel. Uh -uh. I don't know how it works. I'm sure if someone who plays it might say down below to educate me. Because there's so much about this game I don't know. But it's fun. I'll tell you that now. It's a lot of fun. If you like, I can I can show you all me learning to play it. Because I do I do want to play through the story. And I might invite you along to enjoy that sometimes, or I might just show you the really fun battle stuff they have. Don't know. That's it for now. 
do leave a like if you enjoyed this. If you want to see more Honkai the Third, I was just kind of like messing around today, but I can do more. I would like to do more. Show you more of the game. There's a lot here. There's a lot here. I, I don't even know what it all is. It, it means nothing to me. I just follow these missions. They tell me what to do. <laughs> um, I feel like I need to do this. It gives like a thousand experience. I don't want to do this. Oh, one of the things I hate is they have these modes which tell you stuff from parts of the game and lore and stuff you know nothing about. Like this bit has has lore I know nothing about because I haven't played the main story through. That's how far they've got though. Is that? Is that like chapter 32, I think? Yeah, chapter 32. And I'm on chapter 9. Part. So parts. No, I guess part two maybe? Is this all chapter nine? I guess so. But yeah, uh, <laughs> I've got distracted, sorry. So let me know if you, you want to see more. We can do more, we can explore Honkai together. And until next time, goodbye!